Aw, look at him. All tuckered out from a day of chasing nurses. Yeah, it's like a gigantic horny baby. I bet he's having sweet dreams. Welcome to the clinic for sexy foreigners. Tell me what hurts, baby. Oh, I have a bad case of horniness for nurses. What you need is a sexy sponge bath. I like the way you operate. <laughs> How's that? It's not bad. But I sure am. Yes, you are. Nothing, nurse. Maybe you need a little spanking. Maybe I do. <laughs> now, why don't you turn your head and cough? <laughs> oh, what's the problem, buddy? <laughs> what's the problem, buddy? <laughs> Play some ball. Why would you slap me on the butt? <laughs> Is there something about me that would make you think that I, a boy, would like you, another boy, to put his hand on my butt? Ah, uh, no. Then keep your hands to yourself, butt slapper. <sighs> okay, let's. Just play some ball. Yeah. All right, uh, me and Fez are sure to you and Donna be skins? <laughs> Once again, Kelso, you're not gonna fool me into being skins. Loosen up, Big D. <laughs> Fine, we'll be skins. <laughs> oh, look at Mr. Hassan I'm taking his shirt off. <laughs> As if that were something that I would dream about. <laughs> Okay, what is your problem, man? It's just... Okay. Um... Has anyone ever had a dream where you were with a girl? Oh, hell yeah. Miss October. <laughs> hey! And, and you know what I said to her? I said, get the hell out of my dream, Miss October. I'm Donna's man. <laughs> now, has any of you ever had a dream where you were with the opposite of a girl? Like two girls? Sure. See, I had a dream. And it was erotic. And it was about Kelso. What? Wow! Wow! That is awesome! You gotta tell us about this dream. What? No, you don't, Gotta! <laughs> Look at him, he's undressing me with his eyes right now! You undress yourself, you son of a bitch! No. Guys, tell us what happened. And, and don't be afraid to use colorful words like sweaty or fondle or forbidden. Go ahead. Well, Kelsa was a nurse. And there was sponging. Oh! And hey, maybe, maybe the dream continued and we went to find some girls. Well, did it continue? No. What could this mean? Well, isn't it obvious? It means that I'm gay. <laughs> Oh, Mr. Red, I need some advice. I had an erotic dream about Kelso. <laughs> Welcome to the clinic for sexy Kelsos. What can I do for you? Well, I'm here for my super sexy sponge bath. But I have money, so if you do other stuff too. Oh, I'll do anything you want. <laughs> You're one good looking stud. Right back at you, handsome. <laughs> hey, look.
Look who I found. At first, I just thought he was a leprechaun. Fez, I came over here because I want to end this feud, OK? Right here, right now. And if you're not on board, I mean, I, I could spread your crazy, naked, homoerotic dream all over school, but. <laughs> Macho as I am, who will believe you? OK, Fez. Uh, can I just say, as the nurse that was sponging you in your dream, that I'm with Mitch here on the whole not spreading it around the school thing? See, your lady friend here understands. <laughs> Truce? Well, I guess, uh, truth. Good. Here, peace offering. <gasps> Ah, uh, this is tomorrow's school paper. Oh my God, in the front page, there's a picture of me kissing Kelso by the lake. Fez, why are you kissing Kelso by the lake? We caught a fish. I was excited. I kissed the fish too, but of course, they don't show you that.